Hello and welcome back to another episode of Fallout 4. We are here again at the Cambridge Police Station and we are going to be helping the Brotherhood of Steel in the quest Simper Invicta. Uh, now we need to enter the police station and talk to Dance and we'll be confronted by both Halen and, or Scribe Halen and, uh, I forget the other guy's name, the douchebag. So let's go right in there. <laughs> um, so this will be posting, I believe, Sunday, and the last video will be posting Saturday. Reese, that's who it is. Nice work, sir. I didn't do it alone. Halen, Reese, it's time to welcome our newest recruit to the recon team. He shows a lot of promise, and with the proper guidance, I think he has the potential of becoming one of the best. I should joke. Yeah, I'm gonna joke. I'm only in it for the spiffy uniforms. <laughs> yeah? And here I thought you joined up for a sense of purpose and meaning. So you decided to stay, huh? I expected you to take your payment and run. Sarcastic. Let's just hug this out and get it over with. What do you say? You can play it however you want, tough guy. It's gonna take a lot more than completing one mission to impress me. Reese, that's enough. <laughs> like it or not, you're going to have to learn to work together. And you, you need to understand what it means. We're not soldiers of fortune. We're an army, and we've dedicated our lives to uphold the strict code of ethics. If you intend to stay within our ranks, you need to obey our teachings without question. I have a military background. Don't worry. I've spent time in the military. Perfect. Then there's no need to give you a long lecture, so I'll get right to the point. I only ask for two things from anyone under my command. Honesty fall in line, you stay in line. I give you an order, and you follow it. It's as simple as that. Now, before I release you to Halen and Reese for your assignment, there's one last order of business. From this moment forward, I'm granting you the rank of initiate. This is only a training rank. I'm not permitted to grant ranks any higher than this. Fair enough. Fair enough. Outstanding, soldier. Ad Victorium, initiate. He doesn't even know what that means, Halen. Ad Victorium means to victory. In our eyes, defeat is unacceptable because we're fighting for the future of mankind. Our rallying cry is more powerful than any weapon you could ever carry. Remember that. Now, I need you to report to Halen or Reese for your next assignment. Dismissed, soldier. All right. Um, Semper Invicta is done, I guess? Oh, no. Now I have to do their smaller side quests so uh i just realized nobody in the entire wastelands have has ever seen my face uh except for dog meat dog meat here has and codsworth as well but he saw me before the war so that doesn't really count so yeah nobody has ever seen my face which is interesting <laughs> uh yeah <laughs> so let's talk to reese first because his quests are actually Way cooler. You just hey there. You'll understand. All right, out with it. What's your game? Impatient. I don't have time for this. <laughs> well, you better make time if you intend to stay on board. See, that's what I don't get about you. You're not the military type. You're a loner. So I can't figure out why you're sticking around. You got what you wanted, so why don't you hit the road? Good question. That's a good question. I guess. I don't know. You need to choose a side. You're either with the Brotherhood, or you're against it. <sighs> Look, I'm gonna cut you some slack because Dance trusts you. But if you step out of line and put any of my brothers or sisters in danger, I'll make sure you regret it. So, ready for your assignment, hero? Yeah, I'm ready. Ready. Then listen up. Like it or not, one of our most important duties is to keep the Commonwealth clear of the trash. I'm talking about mutants, ghouls, synths. The abominations the damn eggheads caused when they started playing with their toys. This op is simple. I'm gonna send you to a target, and you're gonna terminate everything that calls it home. All the details you need are right here. Don't come back until the job's done. Okay. So, cleansing the Commonwealth. We need to clear out the College Square. Which I believe is gonna be real tough, because I think... Now, if I'm thinking right, this is going to be very hard. I think... 
it's a uh, not an Assaultron. Those are the skinnier ones. Um, oh, I forget what it's called, but it's like a really big, powerful machine. So, there's that to look forward to. Uh, also, I can f fix my gun up. So, first thing we're going to do, move this. Because that was clearly wrong. <laughs> uh... I hope it doesn't send me too far into, like, Boston, because that will be unpleasant. Um, or too far to the east. Oh my gosh. Okay, this might be a couple parts then. Oh, wait. Okay. Cleansing the Commonwealth. Map. Don't be too far, don't be too far. Wait. Oh, okay. It's just right there. All right. Um, first thing we're going to do, though, is we're going to go to Sanctuary. Yes. We're going to upgrade our gun, because we're going to need it when we uh, attack the square. Um, unless we already... Well, yeah, we already cleared it out, didn't we? Oh, well, it needs upgraded anyways, and we did just get that perk in the last episode at the very end, and uh, we need to spend our supplies on our gun, uh, which we have plenty, plenty of supplies. Mama Murphy, what are you even doing? You don't even have a gun. What's wrong with you? She's on drugs again. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Powerful receiver. Um, calibrated. Okay, that's gun nut two. Okay, so what we're at right now is 19 damage. This will put us at 27. This almost doubles our damage. Or no, no, no. Not close. What? Sorry. Uh, advanced receiver. I believe the only thing higher than 27 is the advanced receiver at gun nut rank 2. Which we do have enough stuff for. We could wait... Well, actually, we've got way more than enough stuff. Uh, we don't need the automatic receiver. I don't like this as an automatic gun. I wanted to thank you for helping. Make that. Told me we'd run into you soon. Oh, it all worked out. It all worked out in the end. No, my problems aren't so simple. My son. I understand. I understand how you feel. I lost someone too. But you and I, we're still here, right? We have to go on for them. Wow, I've never gotten that dialogue. Shut up, you drug addict. <laughs> Wait, wait, that opened dialogue. Nah. Never mind. Okay. Now we teleport to the square. Uh, the college square, sorry. There's Lexington. Now, college square. We probably should try and level up before we do some higher level quests. However, I don't really care. I once beat this entire game. No joke. Level 12. Uh, I literally went straight from the vault to the railroad because I was speedrunning it because I was on the PS4 and I was trying to get every single achievement, which I am only five away from on the PS4, where you get the platinum trophy. But uh, last thing I needed was railroad uh, ending. 
which you can't do unless you play through the game again. So I speed ran all the way through the entire game, beat it in like two hours, and uh, <laughs> yeah, I was only level 12 when I blew up the institute. What in the hell was that? Oh. Perfect. I'll just use the mines. Looks like uh, we've got ourselves a uh, shootout with ghouls. Oh my gosh. There we go. Uh, looks like the other ghoul is coming around to surprise us. Or maybe not. Ah, they're not that smart. <laughs> we'll sneak up on him from behind. Um, well, I just saw his head. Come on, little guy. Oh, no. There we go. He's dead now. <laughs> Ten millimeter rounds. Good. We need them because we keep missing. I am clearly not good at aiming on PC. I am very good at aiming like with um I mean at least decent at aiming on uh Rainbow Six Siege. However, I am not so good at aiming for Fallout 4. Maybe it's because I'm using the Alt key. Or because my sensitivity is super, super low. Let's change that, actually. Controls. Um, yeah, that's not it. Uh, gameplay. Ah, let's turn it up to like here. Because I feel like it's just slow. Okay. There we go. It's much better. <laughs> if uh, you start getting sick from this, I am so sorry. But uh, I need to do this so I can actually aim. Alright, desk fan. Not going to take the fire extinguisher or the fuse that's inside of that. Uh, do we? Yeah, turnpine. <coughs> Turpentine. Sorry, not turnpine. <laughs> Don't know what that is. Okay. So, looks like we got some loot over here. 10 millimeter rounds and more 10 millimeter rounds. We've got 205 rounds. Now, the ghouls here are bad. Oh my gosh, maybe just the hitboxes. Yeah, it's definitely the hitboxes. Oops. Yeah, uh, the hitboxes are really bad. Oh. Go away. Yeah, I literally was shooting right at his face. He was in my face, and I shot him, and he somehow didn't get hit. The hitboxes in this are a little messed up. <laughs> but, that's okay. Because we're still alive. We're still alive and kicking. Uh, maybe I'll try the controller again at some point in time, but again, if you remember... We didn't have too much luck with it working. 
also, as you can see, we missed again. So it's not the sensitivity. It is just the uh, gunplay for PC, at least, is not up to par. Also, that's a better chess piece. Uh, which we can equip right now in our inventory and then we go to apparel and oh hmm see this is the first of many that we'll have to think about because this only has three for uh ballistic but ten for um the electric uh like laser rifle and stuff like that however this has eight for ballistic and six so I think we want that more because we haven't really faced very many enemies outside of the Institute that uh, does that does that type of damage however uh, we do have it for in the future so if we need to switch back we always can it's not a permanent thing uh, take that down all right so we need to go into I believe I believe it's this area right here. Uh, crouch down, because... Oh my gosh! What have you done? Lord Voldemort got stuck on the floor. His legs popped out. One of them was completely skinned. That is very unsettling. Ah, uh, I know what this is. Yes, I know what this is. I believe this is just ghouls. There's another college campus where there's a sentry bot. That's what it's called. It's a sentry bot, not a assaultron. Yeah, this is just ghouls. Which we can hit. Is it V? No, it's not V. We've established this before. Uh, no, it's not F. It's not C. No, oh, it's not that either. Is it T? No. Z? No. Um, not entirely sure what it is. Uh, oh, not caps lock. Uh, let's see. Settings. Um, controls. So, how do you enter VATS? I could probably actually make it to where. Q? Okay, let's make it uh, right click, which was nothing before. Uh, which uh, we cannot do. So none of them are still alive. Okay, that's good to know. Double barrel shotgun. Already have it. Anything else? Nope. Chemistry jar. So every now and then we'll just click the uh, VATS button to make sure that uh, we can see enemies before they see us. Because some of the ghouls, though they look dead, are not dead at all. Or even close to being dead. Um, however, VATS will pick them up before we can even see them. So, that, I guess that's a good thing. Um, anything better? Nope. Okay. No, we do not want to do that. That is a fight. We will not win. All right. Um, except how oh my gosh how did we miss literally every shot I'm so confused. Oh, 
Oh, hi there. How's the head? Alright, fine. Screw it. Just shoot the body. Kind of turn-based, like the uh, original two games. Um, where's the other enemy? Okay, he's in here. There we go. He's dead. Don't play the music now. You're a little late. He, he just got shot in the head. Shot in the chest. Shot in the stomach. Ooh, ouch. Sorry, buddy. Um, you made me do it, though. <laughs> uh, none of these, however, are good. You'll always want to shoot those things, because they are annoying. Uh, they'll alert enemies that you're there. Pretty warm money, which we need. Also, right away is good. Oh, more right away. All right, I'm not complaining. <laughs> Buff out. And I believe that's it over here. Oh, no. Stim pack and purified water, duct tape. We're getting everything we can find. Um, these cash registers full of money are great because money is so much more valuable in the apocalypse than uh, it was before. It's like deflation times 50 because already um, the uh, inflation um, was super, super high. It's like a Nuka Cola. It was like 12, 15 bucks. Lock's really strong. Oh, wait, no, we don't want to enter there. Uh, okay. That's empty. Alright. So now we can head down this area. And be careful for ghouls. I uh, really wish. Oh, wow. Okay, that was good. That was a good shot. That one was less good. Um, not sure why controls are so messed up on PC, but they are less than satisfying. Okay, it looks like there's a guy over here. He's dead. He dead? Yep, he's dead. Or at least he is now. <laughs> ah. Dead? <laughs> Alright, bottle caps. Did we check the bodies of the other two? I'm not sure. Alright, let's continue on our way and continue through the sewers. Or, sorry, subway. Um. Uh, this marker on our mini-map will show us some of them, uh, as our quest is just murder everything. So we cannot let anything live, at all, under any circumstance, or the douchebag uh, Brotherhood of Steel player, we cannot let them exist. They should have never existed in the first place. <laughs> Because according to the Brotherhood, the eggheads really screwed everything up. Which, I mean, do you blame them? Wow. Our aiming's getting a little bit better. I can adjust for the, uh... Oh, I didn't mean to take that. He was eating the man? Poor guy. But I can adjust... Oh, man, that was bad lag. Oh, man. Cool it there. <laughs> oh, almost tried shooting him. He's already dead. Alright, we cannot find him. We can, however, unlock a suitcase. Oh. Wait, don't move it. Are you kidding me? Oh, 
Thanks. Only gave me one, though. Because that other one went to, uh... The suitcase. Oh, hi. <laughs> Lag was preventing me from turning quickly. Which annoys me. Oh man, the lag. Oh man, the lag. Alright. Bottle cap mine is good. It's a good source of, uh, um, bottle caps, actually. Tactical hardened. 10 millimeter. It's not as good as what we want, so we're not going to use it. Um, buff out. Okay, that's good. 38 or 308 rounds left arm okay let's put on this new left arm which is so much better and then drop the old one no that is not drop R there we go uh, we do not need that anymore because that has zero benefits some of the other armor pieces like the uh, chest plate uh, chest plate we got earlier we will want to hold on to um ooh pipe sniper rifle we'll take it but uh oh gosh hold on how do i throw a grenade <laughs> um i believe it's just hold down c so fragmentation grenade Catch! Oh no! Ah. No! Get off my dog! Shot him in the ass, then he died. <laughs> the fight's over. They're all dead. Except for this one in here. Oh, he's laying down. Lock tight. Advanced? Didn't we get a perk to upgrade that though? Oh well. We will loot him, and then we'll come in through the other side, which I believe is not locked, or it shouldn't be, or else we can't finish this quest. Oh, it's not even a door. Hello. Oh, yeah, wonderful. Whoa, that was perfect. I'm sorry, dog meat. That was, uh, not good. And I'm on fire. Oh, no, that's not me. Okay. Let's wait for the flames to die down, dog meat, and then we will go in and loot everything. Did not mean to blow you up. Sorry, dog meat. Oh, well. Um bunch of rounds pipe revolver we already have okay colored square station key okay we don't really need it right now but we will eventually so we'll take it bottle caps 10 millimeter rounds sharpshooters hair trigger 10 millimeter pistol wow that's a lot um don't need either of those um unless does this have a scope no, it does not. Don't need it then. Literally, the only ways that it's better is, I believe it's, yeah, better fire rate, less weight, and more valuable. Because when you upgrade a weapon, somehow the value drops, which is very confusing, but it does. Finding something in the wasteland and then finding something in the wasteland and making it better somehow makes it less expensive. <laughs> oh, that door. Okay. That's useless. Thanks, game. Uh, <laughs> so now we can just walk out. Because everything is dead. Could have activated a, all the... Um, 
things over here. All those robots. Oh gosh. What have you done? Okay. I'm gonna leave because it's super laggy. Connecting rod and Gwyneth Ale and teapot. That is nothing that we need. So this concludes our quest and our episode. Uh, we're gonna make our way back to the surface and then fast travel over to Cambridge Police Station to turn in our quest, receive our caps, and then end the episode. Um, I hope that ends Simper Victa as well. I'm not sure though. I think I might have to do the other person's quest as well, unfortunately, but that will be another episode if so. So, let's fast travel there right now. Um, even though it's just a few seconds away, uh, uh, I don't really care. I'm going to fast travel. Because <laughs> why not? Um, and then we turn in this quest, and that will conclude our episode. Remember to get your friends and family, anybody who might be interested in this, to subscribe. Uh, and at 50 subscribers, you have a chance to win Wolfenstein Youngblood or uh, money so that you can get whatever game you want. But it will be for a game, not for anything else. Uh, don't get any bright ideas. It's for Steam or GameStop. I mean, yeah, I guess you could just sell the gift card, but uh, what do I care? It's your money. <laughs> um, anyways... Let's come in here and see if that ends both quests, or just one. Um, I believe it will only end Reese's quest and not the other. Uh, but we can at least talk to her um, and get that quest. Well, look who's back. I take it that area's clear? Uh, I think so. I think I got everything. If you don't know, how am I supposed to? Why don't you come back when you're ready? You entitled douchebag. Yeah. Affirmative. Really. Oh, I should ask for a reward. As worthless as I thought. Report to Paladin Dance. He said he had a mission for you. Oh, yep. That. Ready for another rock. That finishes it. All right. Um. So we're done here. Uh. Because I believe this is just a. We'll we'll talk to him, but I don't think this is a necessary quest. Oh yeah, I know what this is. Sure. Ready. Outstanding. Over the years, the Brotherhood has sent several recon teams to the Commonwealth. The last squad went in three years ago. They never reported back. Officially, they're missing. Presumed dead. And you want me to find out what happened to them? Correct. We owe them that much. Their insertion point was in the hills near Malden. Survey the area and establish a search pattern. Monitor your radio for distress signals. All recon teams are issued distress pulses that put out a short-range homing beacon. If you can acquire a signal, you should be able to trace it to its source. All right. Um, that is completely unnecessary, so we will not do it. Uh, you don't actually have to do it at all. Um, it's the Lost Patrol. It is a optional quest. So, since this is a playthrough, or this is a walkthrough, not a uh, full playthrough. Um, I'm not going to do that quest. I'm going to continue with the main mission, and next time we will head towards Diamond City. <coughs> um, anyways, thank you guys very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.